Hey guys, we're just continuing straight on. We're now going to be finding the uh, reactions and loading in members 1 and 2 from load case wind 2. So to show you back at the question, we have wind 2 over there of 100 kilonewtons. Now, here's a free body diagram. Because essentially this question is just the exact opposite of this one, so it's 100 going that way from the previous one, wind 1, we have 100 going this way, all right? So all that's gonna happen is that because it's the opposite to the previous case, all the reaction is just gonna be opposite. So we had BX before equaling 100 kilonewtons. Now it's minus 100. We had BY before as 33 and a third. Now it's minus 33 and a third. We had AY as minus 33 and a third. Now it's gonna be positive 33 and a third. If you don't believe me, you can go solve it yourself, but this is just to cut time. And in actual fact, when we do the um, uh, the axial loading in members one and two, they're also going to be the opposite sign to what we solved for those previous ones. But we'll see now. So this is from the previous video. We had N2 as minus 66 and two thirds, and N1 is 47.1. You'll see that, that you'll see now it's going to be positive and negative, but we'll solve it anyway, just to show you. So same procedure. We're going to take a cut through there. Now we know that um, BY is minus 33 and a third, so it's going to be going down 33 and a third. BX is negative 100, so it's going to be going to the right now. Uh, we have 100 over there, N1 and N2. I'm not going to even include that, but we have some type of force there. Now, same procedure, taking moments about C such that it equals zero. This one, this one, and this one don't have any lever arms, so we're left with this one, this one, and this one. So it's going to be negative N2 by 5, N2 times by its lever arm of 5 meters going clockwise. So it's negative. This 100 over here is has a lever arm of 5 meters, but this time it's going anti-clockwise. That means it's positive according to our definition. And this 33 and a third has a lever arm of 5 meters, and it's going to be going clockwise. So it's negative 33 and a third. Solving this, so all the